was a terrible month for San Diego's military community. Captain Ted Carlson is the commander of Naval Base San Diego. Definitely in a long time we have not seen this many service members die um, all at once. Obviously we are in a, um, you know, a dangerous job and service members do pass from time to time either from armed conflict or just in the nature of the job that we do. Nine Marines and a sailor from Camp Pendleton were among the 13 who died August 26 during an attack outside the airport in Kabul. Less than a week later, five sailors died in a training accident when a helicopter from the USS Lincoln crashed off the coast. Just two years into his service, Joshua Holmes suggested Friday's moment of silence at Naval Base San Diego to honor all of the dead. Everything that we've been through this past year, just to get hit deep in the month of August, it, it hits deep to heart in the military because you don't ever want to hear that you've lost somebody. Holmes is from Riverside. Several of the Marines killed in Kabul were from the area north of San Diego. His dad is friends with one of the fathers of a Marine who died. This small gesture is going to go a very long way, and I hope that all the families out there see that we remember the fallen victims. We remember every, each and every one of them, from the 13 in Afghanistan and the 5 in San Diego and the Hilo crash. Like We're going to remember each and every one of them for the rest of time. It's one of several ceremonies happening around the county mostly outside of public view, including at North Island, home of the helicopter squadron, says Chaplain Commander Charles Luff. I believe it gives our service members a chance to, that are struggling with this, a chance to find some closure, uh, to find some peace at a moment here, and to, and to reflect on their own service. Funerals have been going on around the country as bodies return home. A makeshift memorial continues to form outside the gates of Camp Pendleton. On a less somber note, the first Marines from the unit sent to guard the airport in Kabul arrived overnight at Pendleton. The rest of Gulf Company of the 2nd Battalion 1st Marines is expected to return to a more public welcome in the coming days. Steve Walsh, KPBS News.